What makes a car special? Is it the latest features, good design and performance to boot, or perhaps its foreseeable impact on the automotive industry? Such a car comes once in a blue moon, and because of this, they usually come with a hefty price tag. Well, not this one. Introducing the Geely Cool Ray. For those of you who aren't familiar with the brand, Geely is a Chinese automaker that now owns more popular brands such as Proton, Lotus, and Volvo. Yes, you heard me right, Volvo. In fact, the Geely Coolray shares the same platform as the Volvo XC40. But despite this, the Coolray holds its own and has a unique identity. Starting with the exterior, the Coolray sports Geely's signature grille called the Expanding Cosmos. You'll find LEDs for both the headlamps and tail lamps. The body lines are simple and fluidic. And it's nice to see that the exterior cameras are well integrated and don't stick out like a sore thumb. The cool ray is also decked out with sporty touches without looking too obnoxious. Looks may be subjective, but I doubt that anyone would disagree that the cool ray is quite a stunner. And if you're impressed with the exterior, wait till you step inside. Just feast your eyes on this interior. One glance and you're greeted with a plethora of different materials and textures. Upon closer inspection, you'll find that the quality is top notch. The materials are soft where they need to be and all buttons and switches feel solid and sturdy. Nothing inside feels like it was just slapped on, which speaks volumes of how well designed the cool ray is. In fact, everything looks like an art piece from the air vents, the door handles, gear lever, and even the pedals. I could only speculate why we don't see more of these vehicles on our roads. Given that Geely is a relatively new player, some might be apprehensive to consider the Cool Ray. But if perceived quality is any indication of the car's durability, then I guarantee that you'll be put at ease once you inspect its build quality, from panel gaps to how well dampened all interior parts are everything seems to be well made. When it comes to space, there's adequate knee and headroom, even with the front seats set far back. The trunk is more than adequate for daily needs or weekend shopping. There's also adequate space for your devices and more than enough USB ports to keep their batteries charged. Nothing in this vehicle feels cheap. In fact, this interior space would not feel out of place next to those found in cars worth twice as much. There's such a good use of different materials and colors to keep things interesting without going over the top. And aside from its aesthetic appeal, the design also excels from a functional standpoint. Take the seat materials for instance. Aside from giving the car a sporty vibe, they are also designed to keep cool under intense sunlight. Current owners attest to this and claim that their days of getting their butts roasted after parking under the sun are gone. The materials also prevent perspiration when driving on a hot day. In terms of ergonomics, all buttons and switches are tactile and within reach. And despite this car's many features, operating them will not require a PhD. Most of all, we would be remiss to discuss the interior without talking about the huge 10-inch infotainment system. This mammoth screen houses audio and HVAC controls, aside from various car settings that you can configure with ease. You can operate the climate control settings via the touchscreen, 
but may also do so with physical buttons and knobs found just below. There are also physical buttons for your audio system's main functions. The top spec sport variant also comes equipped with a 360 degree camera, which allows you to view various angles of the car. This even gives you a great view of what would potentially be your blind spot when you activate the turn signals. The sport variant also has a fully digital LED instrument cluster, which changes its layout depending on what driving mode you choose. The different driving modes varies throttle response, steering feel, and shift points based on which of the modes you select. Other features worth noting include a huge panoramic sunroof, one-touch power windows for all doors, which you can set to automatically roll up after locking the vehicle, and remote start which allows you to turn on the AC in order to cool the interior even before you step in. Last but not least, this car has Park Assist which takes care of both parallel and perpendicular parking with a touch of a button. Now how cool is that? Now if you think this car is all show and no go, think again. Under the hood lies a turbocharged 1.5 liter 3 cylinder motor. Rated output is 177 horsepower with 250 newton meters of torque, which is mated to a dual clutch transmission. That's enough to propel this SUV from 0 to 100 in 7.9 seconds which means this can outrun most other SUVs and sedans in our market. Now that's impressive. So overall, the cool ray is hard to fault. I think the only thing that this model has against it is simply the fact it hasn't been around that long, which means it hasn't had the chance to prove itself in terms of reliability. And despite its superb fit and finish, it will take at least a few more years for us to know if the cool ray can stand the test of time. What's comforting to know though is that the Cool Ray is backed up by a 5 year 150,000 kilometer warranty. Plus the fact that Geely as a company has access to the tech and engineering of manufacturers that have already proven themselves. I will end this video with a stern warning to anyone considering to give the Cool Ray a closer look. Once you see it, be prepared to buy it because I am sure it will knock your socks off and you really won't find anything else quite like it within the same price point.